Hi, I'm Natalie McLean, and welcome to the second annual Great Canadian Wine Match, Red, White, and True North Food, the barbecue edition. This year, we're turning up the heat and the sizzle, we hope, and choosing our favorite Canadian wines to go with our grilled grub. We're getting ready for Canada Day, July 1st barbecues. So what we're going to do tonight is just a little sampling of what uh, this competition entails. It's really meant as a bottoms up, fun way for wine lovers themselves to nominate and vote for their favorite Canadian wines online via social media. And tonight I have with me three really passionate Canadian wine lovers from coast to coast. I'm going to let them introduce themselves and uh, tell them a little bit or tell you a little bit about themselves, what wine they picked, how they'd match it up with uh, their favorite grill grub. I'm going to start with Sarah. Sarah, over to you. Hi everyone, my name is Sarah Mantle. I live in Calgary, Alberta, also known as Beef Country. And I love Okanagan wines and they pair really well with beef. Just like this, Mission Hills Five Vineyards Cabernet Berlot. And Excellent. the thing I love about this is that it's just so versatile with many different cuts of beef. I mean, it's it's got the body and the elegant structure enough to pair well with a steak, but it's also lively and fun or a hamburger, even if you want to keep it casual. So, um, yeah, it's also very economical as well. It's $20 in our region up in Alberta. And That's a great price. Try it. You'll love it. Yeah, absolutely. Is it a blend, Sarah, of uh, different vineyards? The five, You said five vineyards, right? Yes, it's the five vineyards that Mission Hill owns. They take uh, grapes from all five to ensure the best quality possible. Okay, great. Well, yeah, they're a really well-known producer. Good choice, Sarah. All right, so uh, Alberta beef, naturally. Okay, <laughs> that's a good one, good one. All right, let's go over to Matt here in Ottawa, Ontario. Matt, what have you got? Hi, Natalie. Hey, guys. Hey. Um, I am tonight enjoying a delicious rosewood semillon. Mm, very nice. And it is from uh, the Niagara Escarpment, so Beamsville Bench area. And I'm a big fan of that uh, winemaking region. Um, they're producing some really world-class wines there, uh, whites for sure, and reds also. And that's great because, uh, you know, when we can produce uh, both colors uh, with great intensity of, of flavor, color, aromatics, everything, it's, uh, it's, it's very special. So um, I, I would agree with Sarah that I also love um, Okanagan wines and the beef pairings, etc. But I'm, I'm going to the other end of the spectrum with vegetable and sort of barbecued veggies, etc. Uh, maybe some fruit in there as well. So I find this semillon, um, it just works so well with all the tropical um, aromatics and flavor profile. I find it can pair great with um, any sort of uh, grilled vegetables with perhaps a little bit of pineapple, grilled pineapple as well, mm. and then combining a lot of these things into nice summer salads. So it's summertime just about now and fantastic opportunity to uh, get that barbecue going, put some healthy vegetables on there and drink some delicious Canadian white wine. Oh, cheers, Matt. Yeah, that, that uh, semillon is great. Like, And, you know, lots of options with the grilled veggies, even portobello mushroom or exactly. shellfish seafood. It's a very versatile wine. Of course, we're just doing a very hop, skip, and a jump over here with Ontario wines. But, of course, there's Prince Edward County. There's yes. southwestern Ontario. Those are important categories this year. Uh, but we're just giving a smattering, a taste of, of the types of wines and regions that people can nominate. So good choice, Matt. Thank you. Uh, all right, so Adam and the East Coast, how are you representing tonight, Adam? Yes, my name is Adam Bauer. I'm from Lunenburg, Nova Scotia, where I am tonight. And uh, the wine that I've brought with is a Luckett Vineyards Ortega. And Luckett Vineyards is in the beautiful Gasparo Valley in Nova Scotia. Uh, one amazing thing about our wines here that we're known for is they pair beautifully with seafood. And mm -hmm. being in the fishing capital of Canada right now, it's only proper we have a wine that works perfect with seafood. Uh, That's yeah, this this wine, this Ortega, uh, it's a grape from Germany, but it does really well in Nova Scotia. Uh, it's off dry. It has some nice acidity. Uh, you get citrus. You get some honey, some peach, and citrus, of course, pairs beautifully with all seafood. I would throw a you know a salmon fillet in the grill. 
uh, put like a peach and chipotle salsa. Um, there's some nice residual sugar here that's going to help soothe that heat from the chipotle. And why not make it a duo and throw a lobster tail on there too? Uh, we like to throw lobster tail with everything here. So why not, Adam? Why not? And and what time should we be there, Adam? Exactly. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm here anytime. <laughs> All right, great. So uh, again, we've just had a sampling here of the types of wines. We've got six food categories, all grilled from beef to chicken, pork, seafood, vegetables, and of course dessert. Uh, you know, grilled peaches are beautiful, Ontario peaches or uh, Annapolis Valley there, Adam, or out in the Okanagan. So we've got lots of choices, but what we're trying to do is is generate some, some sizzle, some heat around Canadian wines in preparation for July 1st celebrations and uh, get those pairings going so that we have some ideas of, of what to do and what we're going to be pouring in our backyards from coast to coast this year. So thank you, Sarah, Adam, and Matt for um, giving us some, some ideas to kickstart this competition. Uh, let's raise a glass. I'm going to raise a couple of bottles. What I've got here are two uh, ciders from Quebec. Uh, Quebec also produces some very crisp, dry white wines, ice wines. Ciders are also included this year. Uh, lovely with uh, those grilled peaches or grilled fruit. So anyway, cheers, guys, and let's raise a glass together, coast to coast. Cheers. Cheers. All right, Cheers. all right. I'm, I'm doing this. <laughs> all right, so uh, let's kick it off and let's have fun with this. Take care. Thank you. Thanks.